Let me show you the way. You will need my guidance to get through the sandstorm. Welcome back everyone to a new episode of Near Gestalt. This is really just part two to episode eight. And my throat is pretty tired because I started this right away. My throat is probably going to start failing me fairly shortly. And just so you know, no, we, yes, we do have to follow this little girl all the way through the desert into the sandstorm. And I forgot to restore my health at the mailbox. So, uh, let's hope that doesn't fuck us over later. Lead me to the dungeon, little girl. Through the powers of Badger Time Acceleration. Okay, we're finally here. Into the sandstorm. I will guide you through the desert. Please, stay close to me. Deep breath, everyone. Just a little bit further to go and then we will never have to deal with her ever again. Ever. Hopefully. I know she's sweet and lovable and a little girl that might, you know, just well, might as well be Yona. But Jesus Christ, she, she's supposed to be a little girl, and little people are supposed to be fast. Beware the wolves! Not the scorpions. Oh, what the fuck was that? Stop dodging my- ow! Fucking wolves are a pain in the ass, they're possibly- Are you leaving the girl behind? No, I'm, I'm fighting the fucking wolves! Jesus Christ, people just keep misunderstanding my motives. Dead yet? This so you know, is just too much. <laughs> the moment I open my mouth, the sand rushes inside. Vice, you don't even have a mouth. How does Vera deal with this? Perhaps there is some kind of filter inside that mask of hers. Or maybe they're not even human. Maybe they're aliens underneath the masks. I cannot Beware disprove the me because they're. They shut up twice. Jesus, God, there's so many interruptions we had. But maybe they're some sort of sand people. Maybe they look like Kappa. Orange Kappa. That'd be something. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Wow, look at that wolf rock. That was a pretty good flight. Why is it so hot in my room? Stop arguing about rules and follow Fira's lead. Seems to possess almost boundless stores of energy. Boundless stores of energy that she doesn't put towards running. Uh, look, look, she can only move faster than my defensive position. Maybe it will look like she's actually running now. Uh. Blue Badger Time Acceleration, go! This girl must possess extreme patriotism. Look how she gives all for the sake of her prince. And here we are, at the Temple of Kings, I believe it was called. Oh no, the Baron Temple. Well, I was a while off, wasn't I? This is as far as I can go. Okay, we'll take it from here. Oh, and one more thing. Well, at least she was useful for something. But she probably could have given this to me earlier. Welcome to the Baron Temple, a temple of puzzles. Yes, puzzles. For an action-orientated game like Nier, puzzles might seem a little bit out of place. Unusual, even. But I've knocked the shit out of some puzzles in my due time. 
Unfortunately, none of them involve a portal gun. A portal gun would be pretty sweet in Nier, but then this game would just become Darksiders. Speaking of Darksiders, who is stoked for that sequel? I'm sure this is going to bite me in the ass, and someone is going to watch this after Do Dark Stop. Is it Dark? No, Darksiders 2 is released. I keep getting the title mixed up with Darkstalkers, which is a fighting game. They never really got much attention. And so we enter the first trial. The following actions are prohibited in this room. Leaping rabbit. What was that supposed to mean? It couldn't possibly mean anything. Oh. Uh, what now? I guess we'll have to play by the rules. Also, what? I didn't know you could destroy these, actually. Thank you for demonstrating that, Kaine. I don't think you're actually able to were supposed to destroy these at all. The blocks are set up in such a way that you can block most of them, but apparently you can strike them. I wish I had known this because it would have made a lot of puzzles a whole lot less tedious. Wait, what? Okay, they respawned. That explains a whole fucking lot. I just learned something new about the game. Fantastic. And so obviously all these blocks are positioned in such a way that we can interrupt their attacks long enough to get us to the next point. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing. This one's a little bit tricky. You have to pull it across one space. And then push that bitch in front of him. Can't touch this. You might imagine that that glowy block is actually part of our obstructions. Whoa, no, oh fuck! This is what happens when you try to rush things. I completely forgot that they regenerate. Or did I just not know at all? Either way, it does not matter now. The one thing that I do have to complain about with Nia is that why couldn't they have just developed some nicer bullet textures? Because all these magic orbs that all look the fucking same just looks a little bit uh, repetitive. Just a tiny bit, nothing too much. But wouldn't it have been nice for some greens? Maybe a blue in there somewhere. Would have been pleasant, don't you think? Blue's a nice color, don't you think? Then we just block this one off. And we are home free. Normally I fail by this point, simply because of the purpose that I like to do the jumping down slash on the box. And because of that, that's against the rules. Yippee-ki-yay, motherfucker. The first seal is now gone. O oh, master of the trial, it is time to devote yourself to the next rule. I wonder what this missing prince is like. The man is tasked to protect his people, and yet they toil to save him. I think that tells us everything we need to know. Good enough? Feel good. Just a foolhardy band of rescuers, don't mind us. Good enough? Someone's here? There we go. So, as we suspected all along, the prince is here. And look at that skirt. Oh, baby. Oh, God, it's a boy. Where did you come from, boy? Huh? But you're just a kid.
And to top it all off, an owl. Stationary owl, does that possibly mean we cannot stand still in this room? Well, that was unusual. Come on, let's go save him. Apparently so. By all means, we can never stop moving, ever. Ankle whoa, 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 that was really close. Oh yeah, we can jump now, I completely forgot about that. Perfect. You might imagine that the puzzles do get harder as we go on. But that's pretty much a given by this point, no? The one question that begs to the mind is that why would they want the prince? Why at all? Oh, time for some 2D. I like me some 2D. Beautiful. Just absolutely fabulous. So what are they going to throw at me this time? Could be anything. The no masturbating rule. Oh. Racing wolf. Magic spewing bat. Okay. So we cannot run and we cannot use magic. I have the perfect defense for this one. <sighs> Damn it! This shit's starting to piss me off! Kaine! What in the- oh, Are you fucking kidding me? Let me go! Let me- <gasps> I am gonna kill you when I- I assume we'll have to find her as well. Yep. Well, that's a load off my ears. Oops, I forgot running. Shit. Okay, so this is the best way to get through the entire thing. Yeah, this took me a while to figure out, but if you block the orbs, it doesn't count. Oops. Oh dear. Okay, or we could walk and try this. This might work. Will it work? I'm not entirely sure. What? Okay, that's not going to work. Let's just try my old way, shall we? Yes, while you are being hit, you actually remain immobile. So this is going to be a while. Let's just uh, use some of that time acceleration. And with that, we're finally across. Don't screw this up now, Nia. Slowly. Mission success! As you can see, we've progressed a little bit onwards from the first tier. And now we move on to the second. Big fucking whoop, I suppose. What do we not have to do? Oh, this room. I remember this room. I think. Protected turtle. So I'm assuming that means no defense abilities. Do not even think you can get through this room easily. There is absolutely no fucking way. Absolutely none. As for how you get through this room, I'm not entirely sure. I've never actually thought about the way of how you get through here without causing yourself too much harm. But being honest, I found if you keep the pattern consecutive, generally you're pretty okay. You just have to push it far along enough to hopefully maybe get just to the right point. Let's just hope this goes alright. I actually haven't done this part. I haven't practiced it in a while, so I haven't got the faintest clue! 
Oh dear, this could get really, really messy. Okay, so I don't think we can push that one any further. I don't think we can push that one any further either. Okay, so if we push this one just a little bit further, maybe we can take care of it. Maybe? Oh god, my, the tension is getting high here, folks. I am starting to uh, become quite nervous. Actually, we can push that side block one block further before we cut. Dicks! Son of a dick! Okay, we're back to where we were, roughly. I think I've got it. I think. Okay, that was close. Just a little bit further and I think we'll be okay. Just a little bit now. Okay, yeah, we're perfectly fine if we continue on this pattern. There's nothing shooting at me from this angle, so... We should go a little bit further. Be just fine. Maybe if I just reach on over and they've got to stop shooting eventually. Oh Jesus Christ, the flashing animation. Perfect! Progression! That's what it smells like. My sweat, blood and tears. It makes a nice cologne, though. Big empty room, this seems pretty normal. Actually, I think we were just in here. My bad. Probably just have to move down here. Of all places, who would have thought to move down? There's really not a whole lot to say about the architecture in this building, other than it's quite a... Well, where could it be, for instance? I mean, who would have made this building? And why would there be a desert in Tokyo? Magic spewing back, so no magic spewing at all. Oh sweet baby Christ! I can't believe that just worked. Perfect! Nobody can detest my fucking acrobatic madass skills. Biotch! Man, talking like a gangster is so exhausting. I can't even do it. Actions are prohibited in this room. Blade wielding tiger. This madcap barrage of rules shows no signs of slowing. Stop talking, Vice. We're gonna mess this up again. The masked people certainly do enjoy their rules. What a pain. Whoever came up with this system must be soft in the head. Okay, so for this room, sometimes people don't really get it, but dark. Um, wait, which one is it? Dark Blast is actually the best way to be going about this mission. It's a little bit tedious, but it's the best way to break the blocks without using too much of your mana. I don't understand why they would have rules for magic, consi especially considering the situation that, uh... Nier is pretty much the only one with magic in the world at this point in time. This room took me four fucking ever in the past, though, so please... Take it with extreme due diligence and caution. Otherwise, you're going to be here for quite a while. Actually, I tried doing this with just the lance magic. You can only use two of those at a time, and it takes three of them to destroy one of these single blocks. So, please take my advice and never, ever use Dark Lance in this room. Ever. I lost my sanity to it long ago, and then I became the Badger. Okay, I think we can do it this time. 
That's one more. One more. Please, for the love of God, don't douche this up. Oh no, there's two more. Yes! That took me at least 16 tries the last time I did it. I am so glad that I figured that out this time. With my extreme intelligence that I picked up for when I became the Badger, absolutely phenomenal. Nice sandals. The final tier. What could be waiting for us? Huh. Not what I was expecting, but a very pretty sight nonetheless. Two beautifully stretching bi bridges. Bitches. I almost said bitches there. I'm very sorry for all the bitches in the crowd. Nothing bad could possibly happen in this room. Not one bit. Not at all. Evasive mouse. Okay, so we cannot use evasive skills. Should be easy enough. All we have to do is go into our magic abilities and uh, reset some skills. That, that'll be fine. Be fine. Is it me or do these look a little bit greener than normal? It might be the lighting in the room, but I'm not quite so sure about that. And also, I'm not gonna lie, but because of Devil May Cry 3, whenever there's some sort of magic rune or symbol on the door, I always hesitate to go near it. You know why? Oh shit, shit. Get out of my way. Bitches move, but... Because in Devil May Cry 3, that, that weird hand would always come out of the fucking door whenever you got too, too close to it, and it would do damage to you. And also certainly fuck up your combo. Oh, hello. New type of enemy. Nice to meet you, Mr. Enemy. I'm just gonna pick up this item, don't mind me. Strength capsule, that's pretty cool. I'm just gonna try one of these. Boom! Oh, whoops, wrong skill. We've got to do this all over again all of a sudden. Beautiful. Okay, we're back. Let's try that again. With all new strength drop. New word. Just so you know, there are a lot of words in this game. Even through four playthroughs, you cannot actually get them all. Elaborate machine, that'll be useful for upgrading our weapon at a later point. Beautiful. Although, I'm not really sure how all these parts come together into the form of a new weapon, but who am I to judge? The word of the fetch quests will always be unknown to me. And on towards to our final destination, an unceremonious little gate in the middle of nowhere. But possibly the perfect defense. Or they could just blow up the bridge and let you all starve in there. That would be terrible. Oh hell yeah. I love save points, I'm just gonna save right here. Cha-ching! That couldn't possibly mean there's a boss fight coming up. No siree! Not at all. Where are we? It's an odd place to be sure. I suppose that was to be expected. Oh, look! <laughs> the 
That mewling child is inside. Without any rules to bind us, we are free to unleash the entirety of our powers. Less thinking, more killing. I like it. I like it too, Nier. But for now, for this battle, we should equip Dark Lance and Dark Gluttony. Completely disregard what I did earlier. I wasn't even what knowing what this? I was thinking. Boom! So obviously, the um, the old magic boxes. Got to destroy them. That's nice. I'm glad they decided to tell us this. And for your information, those dark orbs, even I though I wasn't magic playing... Within the glowing box. But um, even though I was complaining about the lack of colour, those colourless block uh, well, not colourless, but black balls, yes, the black balls, they are actually un- well, unswallowable, I suppose. The black balls are unswallowable. You know why? I don't know why. It's just to make things harder, I suppose. But as you can imagine, the repetition of the fight pretty much goes on for like- uh, for, for like- for- for something. Oh, I don't even know anymore. I'm not even sure if you can break the blue balls yet. Come on, come on. No, fuck's sake. This is making me dizzy. And it's kind of hard to figure out which one is the black balls and which one is the pink balls or purple, red. All different shades of colours. I don't even know anymore. Come on, recharge that magic. Recharge it! The main reason you want to be using Dark Lance is simply because it slows down time every time you use the magic. Oh, fu for fuck's sake. But unfortunately, you may not always get the proper opportunity to use it. Down one more... Wait. Okay, there we go. I like... No, no, I don't like this. They're moving much slower, much easier to hit, but also much more of a pain in the ass. Please let me have enough healing items for the rest of this battle. Bullet hell at its finest, ladies and gentlemen. But as the gay community knows, that I am an excellent ball dodger. I dodge balls all the time. Oh, Jesus Christ, I didn't realise my health was so low. Please recharge, please recharge. We haven't even gotten it down to halfway. Nothing could be worse than that. Could it? Really? Oh. Yeah. The guardian of this temple is a curious sight indeed. Says the talking book. Oh fuck, shockwaves! Ah, my one enemy! Why are you not turning pink? Turn pink! Why do you refuse to turn pink? I actually forget the reason for why they are not turning pink. Actually, no, I haven't the foggiest. This I haven't played a powerful foe. Kaine, stay there. I'll take care of this loser. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I figured you'd come back. Don't get all weepy, okay? It's not like I was searching for you. Though you were simply lost. Fuck off, book. So yes, after that short cutscene, it all comes the flooding back. The cube me. takes priority. Screw your priorities! I'm gonna kill this thing my way! Ladies, they never listen. But yes, it all comes flooding back to me to how the rest of this battle goes for now. This should prove interesting. Ugh, Jesus Christ, just looking at this thing makes me nauseous. It's such an unusual boss battle, just a reconfigurating amount of cubes. But then again, I suppose that's pretty much what um, N64 games were at the time. Just nothing more than a floating mass of cubes and polygons. That did not indeed signify any sort of shape or matter. I really have nothing to say about this boss battle. Dodge the balls. That's all I have to say. Dodge them. Dodge all of the balls. Oh, and the lasers. The lasers might be an important thing to dodge too. Just saying. Why did I try to hit that? That was a terrible shot. We only have two more health items. That's great. First row defeated. Three more to go. Come on, magic, please recharge faster. Actually, there is always a tactic that we can take in such situations. And that is to go into our word edits. If we go into our words and modify them just a tiny bit. Modify... Okay, we can't modify that. Please, why, why do you not have... Oh dear. Okay, so that plan's out of the book. We do not have any MP recovery options, so that we cannot re recover our magic any faster than we already are. That's a bit of a ball buster. Or block buster, should I say. Oh, ho, ho, I'm so funny. Whoa. And that's one more row defeated. Come at me, bro. Your bros will be defeated. And furthermore, so will your blocks and your balls and your... What is that? I don't like the looks of this. Please leave me alone. I don't... I, look, just keep the hot lasers off of me. I don't care what you do. Just keep them off of me, bro. Don't laser me, bro. That's another row defeated and I just walked into a black ball. So many balls to walk into, so little time. Doesn't it remind you of being a child? In the bouncy ball pit. Just a little bit more. No, no, no. Oh, do we have any magic drops? Yes, we do. Come on, please recover. Yes, that really just happened. That was a Legend of Zelda reference. Kaidam, Yuri, Zusada to Otachi. Kaidam se to Bella. Kaidam de Sara to Yuto. Shia to Tonsa to Chi. Ushitsugu. Koski, Sansara. Eo, Sietekita. Peru. 
海山アサキカエサラトアヤーリアトルールタタユリタサチヨーリョカイロン押してキルタチエクググリスアーガイウカヤーリカイザムアーチエテスレタダそれでカイザムチタレルチロンデクカイロン And with that, the dungeon is complete. Finally. But I don't really know how wise it is to have a child for a king, and he's a bit of a dick right now. But we'll get to know him over time. He will be a returning character, and he will become actually quite badass. I appreciate the offer, but I'll have to pass. My wish. Well, it kind of has to take care of itself. Kosa. Andarare. So they. I think he just gave us an order. A new wish. Fine. I want you to make rule zero. And it's going to say that if people don't like a rule, they can vote to change it. A splendid idea. Yori Saro. Elpa Chista. ペルアトルトシ恩人はくれたいペルアトトタトだあんだサンキトシチチステトエオカイザムサラトスアシエテキッタコスキウカアエテスレタだ。Thanks, but I think you're forgetting someone. Hey. Ah, yes, the foul disease that claimed my father's life. We heard you were searching for a cure. Did you ever learn anything? I'm sorry, no. Everything we tried ended in failure. It seems there is no way around it. We have to ca collect the sealed verses one by one. Yeah, thankfully, there aren't too many left. Pardon me, but what are the sealed verses? We're not sure, but if I find them all, I can save my daughter from the Black Scroll. You... don't know what they are? I don't know and I don't much care. I just want to save my daughter. I'll run around collecting a bunch of crystal horse manure if that's what it takes. Well, that's nice. Anyone to talk to? Should I do anything? How about you? Can I ask you to visit us again? To return as friends? Sure, why not? Just try not to get yourself kidnapped again, hmm? And we learned a new sealed verse, the Dark Wall. Defensive barrier, charged to increase the size of the wall. Never really used that skill much myself. But with that, we can say I'm goodbye to Facade. Let's go back. Well, that sounds like a splendid idea, but that will be for another time. I'll see you on the other side, Badger recruits. I'll see you there. That was been, that was been, that has been, Facade.